Welcome back. In this step, let's play around with the point cuts a little more. In the previous step, we used an execution point cut and we defined a simple point cut. So here we are saying in this package, any class, we would want to intercept any method which is called with any kind of arguments. And I don't care about the return type of it as well. So that's what we have defined and we saw that this intercepted two business calls. Let's see a few more examples of this. So now I'm removing business. So what it does is now when there are two dots next to each other, what would happen is this would start intercepting all calls inside this sub package. So inside the spring AOP, any calls will be intercepted. So let's see what would happen now. I'm running this again. You can see that a lot more things are getting intercepted. So you can see check for user access, allowed execution for spring AOP application dot run. So this is the original run of the Spring Boot application that is getting intercepted because that's inside the package com in 28 minutes Spring AOP. And also you'd see that the business method call is getting intercepted. You'd see that the DAO method call is getting intercepted, the business method call and the data is also getting intercepted. So it's very powerful. The way you define your point cuts is very, very important. You don't want to be wrong with how you define your point cut. So here, I'm when I put business, I would only intercept the business stuff. When I now put data in here and call the business method, the business method in turn will invoke the data method. So now you would see that only the data methods would get intercepted. So you can see that now there is only the data methods which are getting the DAO methods which are getting the interceptions. One of the things I would recommend you to do is to try and play around with the point cut. So try and have different packages in here, create different beans and try and play around with it. Let's do a quick review of the terminology which is used by AOP. One of the things which I have been using is point cut. Point cut is this expression. So the expression which defines what kind of methods I would want to intercept is called a point cut. The second important terminology is this. This is called an advice. What should I do when I do the interception? So when I intercepted a method call. What should I do? The logic here is called a advice. A-D-V-I-C-E. So this is basically what we are giving as a advice. Do this. That's the advice we are giving. So this is point cut. The expression which we have in here is a point cut. This is advice. And the combination of point cut and advice is called an aspect. So an aspect is a combination of your join point plus your advice. What kind of methods to intercept plus what to do. That's your aspect. The last important terminology is the join point. The join point is specific interception of a method call. So the business one dot calculate something is getting called. It's being intercepted. And that data is present inside the join point. Join point is a specific execution instance. So if this is intercepting 100 method calls, then there would be 100 join points. Process where this whole thing gets weaved around your code is called weaving. So what is happening here is whenever I'm defining this aspect, the AOP framework, the Spring AOP framework is ensuring that this is getting executed at the right moment. This process is called weaving. And the framework which does this is called a weaver. So the things which we are talking about are weaving and weaver. The process of implementing the AOP around your method calls is called weaving. And the framework which implements it is called a weaver. That's very simple, right? When we are talking about things theoretically, it becomes really complex. But when we look at an example and talk about all these concepts, these are really simple things to understand. So let's quickly revise. This is a join point. It defines what kind of methods we would want to intercept, what kind of executions we would want to intercept. This is advice. What do we want to do? A combination of point cut and advice is called an aspect. A specific execution interception is called a join point. And the framework which does the entire logic of making sure that the aspect is invoked at the right point 
is called the weaver and the process of doing that is called weaving. That's all. Those are all the important things that you would need to understand about AOP. In this step, what we looked at is the point cut and also some of the terminology which is associated with AOP. Until the next step, bye-bye.